since leaving Newcastle in March last year, I visited all the big hospitals en route and they're all telling me the same thing, is it's a desperately needed where, where they are. Treatment and transport have to be integrated. That, that's the key to the success in the northeast of England. When, when the medics are planning the treatment plan, they should also take on board how the patient is going to get there. Because when you look at outpatient uh, appointments, it, the chemotherapy, the radiotherapy is difficult, it, undoubtedly, it's no point in saying anything else. But the worst part about the, 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 the treatment isn't the med medication, it's the transport. Again, it's a worrying thing that I've found out over the last 10 or so years is how many patients either don't go ahead with the treatment because it's so difficult to get to and from hospital, or once they've started, the difficulties of getting to and from hospital are so difficult so they elect to um, give up the treatment. And my goal is that we do one million cancer patient journeys that aren't currently being done at the present moment. The way we're hoping to set it up is obviously, say for example, Dublin or Belfast is the case maybe. Members of the, 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 the hospital staff will visit the big hospital in uh, Newcastle to see how we do it. Then we would then come back to say the Dublin and, and, and Belfast and we, we would set up a hub in this city which would then copy what we're doing in Newcastle upon Tyne and all the technology that we've got we would provide free of charge. We would also provide the first ambulance free of charge. Hopefully we will be able to show them how to do it and what we're doing in Newcastle they'll have the same success. I know it sounds a lot, I know a million cancer patients but it really is just scratching the surface. I think when it gets onto a high, it could possibly be 10 million cancer patients. Because if you think we can do 40 to 50,000 in the northeast of England, you don't have to be a great mathematician to look at all the other centres in Great Britain and Ireland to say that that figure can well exceed it.